Coverage you can count on begins with no smoking in the city of Barnwell, South Carolina. City leaders decided this week you cannot light up in town. More now from News Channel 6's Sean Cabot Stock. The city of Barnwell is joining a number of communities, not just here in South Carolina, but across the nation, and banning smoking at a number of city owned properties. It's just the right time for healthy living. Most of our city owned property, uh, the buildings, are smoke free, but um, there's never really been a policy written. So we've made it official at this point. The city of Barnwell now joining the smoke free bandwagon. To make sure that um, the smoking environment does not affect other people who do not smoke, and uh, so we wanted to make sure that we took care of that. It formalizes as well as expands the plan to include all city owned buildings, vehicles, parks, and outdoor events outside of those parks. Once the, these businesses and municipalities learn the dangers of secondhand smoke and the benefits of a smoke-free workplace and smoke-free lifestyle, they are more willing to put these policies in effect. Hillary Hyman with Access One Center in Barnwell has worked closely with municipalities and the school districts to get policies updated to include alternative nicotine products, which are vape pens and e-cigarettes. Now partnering with the city to make the area healthier. This grant um, works on policy change um, within workplaces, school districts, um, and the community as a whole. As well as local businesses. We are in recruiting for the workplaces um, to participate in the smoke-free workplace policy change. We've been working with the local senior centers on education. Enforcement comes from? Through our parks recreation um, staff as well as any police officers if needed. You can expect to see no smoking signs at parks like this one in the next few weeks in Fuller Park in Barnwell, South Carolina tonight. Sean Cabbage Dunk, WJBF News Channel 6. If you would like to partner with Access One on committing to a smoke-free working environment, go to our website, accessthenumber1.org. We have that at wjbf.com.